I went to the Dollar Tree this week to shop for some decorations for an event that I'm planning later this month. It's a summer night's dance and um, I came home with much more than I anticipated as always because Dollar Tree, as you all know, is super inexpensive and you can find just about anything in that store. So without further ado, let's get started. So tomorrow um, we are planning a yard sale. So what better way to get prepared than to buy um, some yard sale stickers. Um, there are 420 count, so 420 stickers in here. So for a dollar, that's a great deal. I also bought two garage sale signs. They're um, coming up yellow, I think, on camera, but they're neon green. Um, I bought this five pack of poster board where I can make extra signs if I need to. So that's pretty awesome. That's the first time I've actually seen those there, but let me know if you shop Dollar Tree and you've seen those um, before. I have been doing a lot of landscape and garden stuff and my dog actually dug up the mulch that I laid down in front of our home. I'm going to plant some flowers in these really cute tins that I found at the Dollar Tree. Um, I found this one and they're pretty big. Well, I don't know. They're medium size, I guess. Um, and then this one in this design. I did find this pinwheel and um, it's just something really fun that will add a cute touch to my garden up front. And then one of my favorite things that I have seen um, before but I never picked up were these two, I have two of them. Well anyways, it's a flip flop stone for your garden. I thought it was super cute. And this one that has a butterfly. The first thing that I picked up uh, was these mushrooms, stems, and pieces. And I go through these a lot because I love them in my omelets. And for a dollar, you can't really beat this size jar. And it's uh, 10 ounces worth of mushrooms, and I bought two of those. Also, I've been wanting to try some of their spices, and I picked up this New Orleans-style seafood and chicken seasoning. And I also bought this Steakhouse-style steak and chop seasoning. I actually found this on another um, channel, and I will put it on the screen right now. I can't think of her name right now, but I always watch her. Um, but yeah, so that was a YouTube buy for sure. And I really didn't buy too much, just this bag of rocks. But they're white and they're gonna go in my living room because I wanna add brighter colors and um, I figured this would do the trick. So just a bag of rocks. I bought Dexter, our dog, a dog toy. I bought him some Canine Prime Munchie Chews and he loves these. These are in bacon flavor. I did find these sore muscle and back soaks and most of these I usually buy for my husband because he's in sports and in the military and they do a lot of physical fitness. So he's always really sore. I found this one and I also picked up the one in lavender. Let me know if you've tried these before um, because I'm not really a bath kind of person. I prefer shower but um, I've been wanting to do one of these soaks and um, see how that is. Um, so I also got some cleaning supplies. Um, the first two I was really surprised to find because I've never seen them there before, but my local grocery store sells this brand. It's called The Home Store, and I found like the Glade generic version of the refills, and for a dollar you can't beat that. This one is in... Uh, ocean breeze I also picked up another one in the scent lavender so pretty awesome deal because when I buy the two pack um, the Glade version of it it's usually 488 at Walmart so for $1 a piece that's a really great deal the third thing that I found um, was this Lysol clean and fresh 
And what's pretty awesome about this is this little bottle can make um, five gallons worth of disinfectant and I thought that was a really great deal for one dollar. And I also picked up a pack of Breezy uh, dryer sheets and these are really strong. Like I can really smell this through the package. Totally worth it. There are 55 dryer sheets in here and I've been using these for a while. So for one dollar, that's not bad at all. And last but not least, I want to show you everything that I purchased for the event that I'm planning. Um, aside from these streamers, you can actually find just about any color of streamers at the Dollar Tree. And as you can see, I have blue and gold. If you watch basketball, the Warriors are in the NBA Finals. The first thing that I found, um, which I had to get for table centerpieces, is this cute little palm tree. It sits like this, but isn't that amazing? I love it. So I picked up four of these because I'm still not sure how many tables we're going to need. Um, but I wanted to grab some just in case they run out. Um, the second thing is this wall decoration and it's um, we're setting up a photo booth so I figured we could hang this up in the background and do photos from this flamingo and flower style backdrop. Again, all of this is one dollar so totally scored on this. Um, excuse the background noise because my stepdaughter went outside to play basketball and there's like a bunch of other noise going on too. Um, I also found this hanging decoration pom-pom and it covers up to it says nine feet so that's pretty good. I found some really really cute tablecloths that can work for any party that you're having this summer and it's basically ice cream cone and watermelon and tea uh, tablecloth and it's super cute and super festive. I bought two of those and then I bought this one which has beach balls all over it. I also found an inflatable palm tree which we're gonna use as a prop for the photo booth. And this decoration strings that is a six pack and they just hang from the walls. So that's all for my Dollar Tree haul. I really hope you enjoyed this. Um, Go Golden State if you're a fan. Let me know in the comment section down below. Go now if you want any of the summery de decorations that you saw in this video because I literally went yesterday to go find this stuff. So um, thank you again for watching. I hope you stay tuned and I do have a thrift video coming up shortly. So stay tuned for that. Bye.